good. Some days are better than others, but it's always good. So I have something to bring to you from the paper. I want everybody to know, when I get up, get back from the gym, sit at the table, I look at the paper. Now, it's funny that I don't go right to the sports page. <laughs> Every time since Market America has come into my life and I got my one done and I had more money, I'd go to the money section. So, flying down on Tuesday, I look at the paper and I see, oh my God, first part, boomers don't give up your day job. Now, you may not know this, but I'm a baby boomer. Now, <laughs> based on this, it says that we can't retire because we just don't have enough money. Now, immediately I'm thinking, I can fix that. I can fix that. I'm a big thinker. So I go to page two to follow up, and it says over 50% of the people 50 to age 60 have less than three months of cash on hand should something happen. I'm saying, oh my gosh, I can fix that too. <laughs> then I read on and it says things are changing dramatically. I hope we should do something, but then the real article came up. Big money section, buffalo wings, crisis. <laughs> now, I don't know about you, but a good chicken wing is amazing. <laughs> now, I know it's not transitions friendly. However, I want you to know with the Super Bowl coming up, they're worried about not having enough chicken wings. <laughs> they serve 160 million chicken wings in New Orleans. Now, the point, isn't that amazing? That's because all those people from Baltimore, they eat a lot of wings. All right, okay. So, I'm going on, I'm saying, this is serious. I mean, one thing is about not having money, but no wings? Holy cow. So, I go back to the front page, and I finally read the headlines. And I'm saying, hey, I heard of this company. I recruited somebody that chose this company over Market America. It was called Fortune High Tech. Shut down. They closed up. They went in and chained up their warehouses. They call it an illegal pyramid. And you know why? Because 90% of the commissions were based off of recruiting commissions versus selling products. And we are a retail-driven company, ladies and gentlemen. And I'll tell you right now, I thank my lucky stars that I met J.R. Reininger because at the time, I don't know why I believed him, but I did. 21 years ago, he wasn't as cool as he is today. <laughs> I remember the days. Right, Andy? We remember. But I will say this right now. Ladies and gentlemen, you are in the right place at the right time, and by golly, the right people. And we are together to take action and make something happen. Make something happen. But here's the bottom line. The bottom line, when we leave, we're going to do something. I don't care. Create a mess. We'll help you clean it up. Just do something. Okay? JR used to tell me, Dennis, just go out and do something. Create the mess. I'll help you clean it up. I never knew what that was until all of a sudden you had six, seven, ten people at once want to come in the business and you don't know what to do. So, oh, my God, I can't believe it. They're coming in the business. You know? So... <laughs> So, because really, what is it that we have? What do we really have? And I want to spend this time to set the stage for the rest of the event. I want to talk about why we're in the right place. And I want to show you what you have to do to be successful. So when you learn from all of these fabulous trainers over the weekend, you will know how to position it to get your success. Okay, does everybody understand that? Now, for the guests that are here, this may be just a little bit above your head. It's eighth grade education. Now, the point that I'm trying to say is, is as we go into this, remember the stage. 
The world has gone digital, period. Today, I don't see the internet going away. I don't see the phones, the smartphones going away. The discussion is, how early does my child get a phone? Okay. And now, because you can't decide between a droid and an iPhone, you carry two. <laughs> Believe me, ladies and gentlemen, it is digital, and it's only going to grow. And also, entrepreneurism is at an all-time high, and why? People don't have job security. People, 50% of the people who get jobs today are overqualified, period. And they want job security. We also know that with job security, you can have control of your finances. Fact. That's amazing. And when you think about that, and you think about the fact of personal development to help you maximize your human potential, I've always said man's greatest waste is that of his own human potential. Ladies and gentlemen, when you're in business for yourself, yes, it's scary. Yes, it takes work. But you stretch yourself beyond means, and you grow. You'll grow. And I think those of you that have been with us for years know that. Did you know over 7,000 people turn 65 every day? And at the same time, the government says, don't start collecting Social Security till you're 70. Okay? They don't want us to quit anymore. Because there's this huge spurt of baby worms coming up that's putting a stress on things. And ladies and gentlemen, if you really want to get your act together, don't count on the government. Period. No matter what country you're in, don't count on the government. That's why we're here. And we do this through product brokering and distribution. We use proven systems, internet technology, social shopping, time leverage, and of course, the power of people. Now, every one of you should have this type of understanding of what you have. And if you don't understand what you have, please copy it, conceal your source. You can say you said it, it's okay. You can say it's all yours, okay? Now, your strategic advantage as we look at this, it's a dynamic business model. Things change, that's what that refers to. But understand, people love to buy but hate to be sold. And if we understand that, we know that by building relationships and listening and sharing information, they'll initiate the purchase. Also, as a product brokerage, we have the attraction to bring in more customers while keeping our current customers by buying more. And ladies and gentlemen, when you get that philosophy, it separates us from the traditional retailing business because you're backed by 50 million products. If you can sell the first product, build the relationship, and then have enough capability to share this beautiful shop.com site, and help them with their challenges, you will build an amazing best customer base. So this is an advantage. The systemization and structure, it's all about duplication. The power is in the duplication. And Alice, you know that, and I know that from the years that we've been doing it, but it's all about the structure. Don't get intimidated by our unfranchised structure. Embrace it. Embrace it because it's taught universally. The profitability and stability part of this, I love it, I embrace it because the little guy can make money immediately through retail profits. We always have to remember it. First and foremost, cash flow keeps your business going. Recruiting is essential, but you have to have cash flow so that you can recruit comfortably and not be under duress when you're going about it. And all oh, businesses that can be passed on I will say this with two daughters who are very intelligent. They encourage me to work my business every day. <laughs> because they know, right, Kevin, as your children know, that when we're off to pasture, it's all theirs. And the beautiful thing is, it's the best kind of wealth because it's non-taxable because they didn't get the money yet. <laughs> so think about that. Now, 
Other things, the management performance compensation plan. I absolutely adore this. What an ingenious plan. What a strategic advantage built on what the average person can do. Ladies and gentlemen, do not let the oceans of information that come by this stage confuse you. The business is very simple. Everything that you learn and you'll see me discuss over the next few minutes is things that will help you do the simple things better. You pick and choose what works best for you to accomplish those results producing activities. That's what's gonna make the difference. Also, when you think about weekly commissions, then the accrual of volume, it was so cute, somebody was telling me they were having a conversation with an individual, and they said, well, I understand it, but what happens after the first 30 days? Do you lose everything you work for? No, it actually accrues for an entire year. You're kidding me! You see, ladies and gentlemen, if you know your strategic advantages, you will know how to captivate the people that you speak to. Volume search to infinity, no levels. Can you imagine this? Big Al Yench, if you've never heard him, you got to hear it because he's got a unique way of sharing this business. And when he starts talking about 100% of 100% comes through your business, you just got to go, wow. And I'll tell you what, Al, congratulations to an executive director. You are a great example with your beautiful wife. Absolutely. Now, volume placement. Hey, listen. When you sponsor somebody, you can make an order, look in your team, and see who's working and place volume to kick a commission check. Joanne, isn't that awesome? But let me remind you, don't freak people out with the money that can be made because until somebody covers their overhead, shelter, food, it's very hard for people to dream. So keep what you share to the environment that you're in. An extra $1,000 a month makes all the world in a difference. Don't be selling 187000 a month. You know, think about it because people got to establish the staples before they can dream forward. Also, affordable startup cost with what the guys did with the Fast Start Kits. I am so proud to be affiliated with this team. They work so hard, and I will say this, every one of you should thank these corporate team members that work so hard for our success. All right, absolutely. Now, if you don't know this guy, good for you, but one day you'll be in front of him. Now, Kevin, by the way, is the most unique individual I know. If something's broke, he can fix it. And primarily, we were talking the other day, and he said, you know, the market America strategy is correct. I mean, okay, all right, Kevin, I'm happy to hear you being so positive. Because uh, I was saying, why aren't we recruiting more? He says, no, listen, really, the market America strategy is correct, but in reality, the strategy never fails. He says it always comes down to implementation and execution that determines the success or failure of the strategy. And when you stop and think about that, it's not that we don't know what to do. It really isn't. I mean, when I just think about what we provided through the Getting Started Guide, through the NMTSS, the trainings that we have, and the responsible sponsoring that should be going on, this really should be like a no-brainer. Now, let's talk about what it takes. Every one of you must have this if you're going to succeed, and that is your why. And the why has to be something. A why is not an action plan. A why that says call three people, show the plan once a day, you know, run around the block three times, that's not a goal. That makes me tired. A goal when you write it is that it's January of 2014 and today I'm taking the day off because I am a national supervising coordinator and I just received a weekly commission of $2,500. That's a goal. That's a goal. Now that makes me feel good. Now the other thing I want you to know is that it's something that you have to be able to spend time in. Ladies and gentlemen, 12 to 15 hours is not a lot of time. You watch three times that amount of television every day or in screen time every day. You can find this if you have a what? A big enough why. So why comes very important. You have to be coachable and follow the proven systems. And the steps to success 
this is real simple. If somebody says, what do I have to do to reach my goal? It's simple. You're going to do the Getting Started Guide and build out Base 10, 7 Strong. You're then going to move to become an unfranchised owner. And once you become an unfranchised owner, you're going to requalify as an unfranchised owner, unfranchised owner every calendar quarter. That's what it is. It's not hard, but you have to be able to comprehend that. Now, if you want to break down your business, where do I spend my time? Well, 80% of your time has to be going towards the results producing activities. This is like fundamental, sell products, sell the business, and sell tickets. Now, ladies and gentlemen, out of a 15-hour week, 12 hours go to the results producing activities. So if you're ever confused on where should I work, go to the results producing activities. Very, very simple. Second, the support activities are 15% of your time or approximately two hours a week. And these are things that are supporting you in learning and implementing the results producing activities. But be very careful of the potential trap that lies here because some of you are professional meeting goers. You go to so many meetings, you don't have any time to build your business. And I can appreciate your thirst for knowledge, but ladies and gentlemen, you've got to get bruised up a little bit to be able to get good at this, right? I mean, right, Nina, right? All of us, we know that, Julie, without a doubt. And I will remember this in the early days, Keith, you running around like crazy. And you know, you used to do it so well, and when somebody didn't see what we were doing, you just said, that's your problem, and left. But the point is, you've got to get out there and do the results producing activities, but these support activities help you refine that. But don't get caught into the trap. The next part is your breakdown of housekeeping. Folks, you don't have to be a master of the back office. You just got to know how to use the back office so you don't lose checks and you maximize your income. That's all. Don't be looking at the back office too long, all right? Because you're not making any money. <laughs> all right, now, all right, three things I just told you there. Remember that. Now, the main objectives when you come into our business is number one, build two sales organizations and distribution organizations that generate in excess of 5,000 business volume coming up two legs, okay? In the United States, it's 2,100. And New Taiwan dollars, it's 66,500. In Australia, it's 2,100. In Hong Kong, it's 16,100 Hong Kong dollars. In Great Britain, it's 1,190 pounds. I mean, imagine how many people's lives would change just with the fundamental weekly payout of business volume. And you have to do that by selling products and developing preferred customers. And I put up here your best customers. Ladies and gentlemen, you have to remember when you have a customer, that's just the first stop. You have to make it a good customer so they come back. You have to show them the value. And if you're not doing that, you've got to get better in your service because sell is service, interchangeable. All right? And your customer, when they got a problem, fix it. Go in there and make the difference. And if you have to bite the bullet, bite it. Okay? Just fix it when your customer has a challenge. Now, here's where I want you to go. To be a great retailer, you must be a product of the product. There is no substitute. And for those of you that sell websites or our financial plans, you need to be more of the product of the product and take more of the consumables with the major products that you focus in because you have to build share of customer. Now with that, you need to become a Mark in America household. Use as many Mark in America products as you can so that you gain belief and you're able to gain confidence in sharing the benefits of those products. And you can do it over a period of 90 days, but you really need to make that happen. And ultimately, you'll create a shopping annuity that you'll hear more about. That ongoing income that is created by your teams all becoming Market America households and helping the preferred customers become Market America households, saving money and earning money at the same time. We sell our business or expose our unfranchised business, and we sell tickets to the next upcoming event. Ladies and gentlemen, if you are fortunate enough to be around an NMTSS community, 
Let me make a very strong recommendation. You always buy three tickets to the next event minimum, and you never ask who's talking because it's the next great speaker coming to your town. All right, everybody remember that. Don't worry about it. We've got plenty of good speakers. If there's an event in your community, just buy the tickets, think later. If I go back and think about what Elizabeth Weber did in the beginning when JR used to just tell her, just get 10 people here, buy 10 tickets. She bought 10 tickets. She didn't ask questions. She sold 10 tickets. She just did what she was supposed to do. So you have to do the same. It's automatic. You have to take advantage. And if you don't buy your three tickets to international convention and get one free, you are just not thinking. You are just not thinking. That's a savings of $200. That's bad business if you don't do that. It's just the right thing to do. All right. Now, you sell the ticket. You expose the plan to a very important note to someone who has communicated that they have an interest. Don't show this business to somebody who really doesn't want to see it. You see, the secret of power recruiting is very simple. Only show the plan to people who want to see it and you're halfway home. I mean, what are we thinking about here, people? All right, so I, I'm laying this out. I know for some of my partners here, it's traditional information, but we've got a lot of young rookies in the room, and I gotta tell you, you gotta know what we do. So let's address a plan of action that includes your objectives. All right, I'm gonna make this very easy, and I think if we can help each of you become a professional coordinator, earning between $4,500 US dollars to $7,499 US dollars in a four-week period, would you be happier than you are now in your commission structure, okay? Good. And to get this, we want to spend 12 to 15 hours a week and while it costs only $129.95 to come into the business, I'm very comfortable saying that you'll need $500 to $1,500 in startup cost, all right? <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, get comfortable with your business. Don't be afraid about asking for money, all right? Don't. You've got huge value. That's one of your biggest mistakes. You try to get everybody in as cheap as you can. And, and people say, well, they don't have any money. Well, it's funny. When their car breaks down, they seem to get it fixed. When their TV in working, they find a new flat screen somewhere. But you see, I understand that because people don't want to take from their savings because they don't believe enough in themselves to invest in themselves. But I'll tell you right now, you know whose fault that is? It's not theirs, it's yours because you're not selling good enough. You're not convincing the person that you understand how you can fix what's broken in their life. Because maybe you don't have the confidence because you don't know what to do. And that's why I'm doing this presentation. All right. Now, you can control. I'm just telling you what it is. You can control this business. Listen to me. But you can't control everything in this business. But here, you can control Market America branded products being sold, and you can control what your team sells in Market America branded products. So thus, you can control commissions and your BV bonuses, all right? Now, to get what our goal said, you need one business development center open in green flushing, going through every week five and five and earning the $1,500, okay? Three to four times a month. You will need to personally sponsor eight Go Now distributors, eight. Two legs, eight. Personally sponsor eight. Now, you might get lucky, and the first two might work for you, but it ain't often, okay? So let's just think eight. Four on the left and four on the right. And so let me show you or tell you what a go now is. Because we do have waiting and stable distributors, but go now is where we want to spend our time. They implement the getting started guide. But you say you're not using the getting started guide? Well, you need to start, okay? You need to be a good follower. A self-starter. Get up every morning. Geo, go. Yeah, baby. And the only way you know that is if you have the why. Gee, that was the first thing we talked about. Master the basic five and show the plan. 
show the plan. Please show the plan. All right, please. Those who show the plan make the most money. It's documented. And shame on you if you're waiting for somebody to show the plan for you. And always remember, when you show the plan to somebody new, no matter how bad you are, they don't know the difference. Okay? So just show the plan and then book it with your senior partner. You'll be fine, okay? Just remember that goes with take a few bruises, take a few bruises, and it gets better. All right. Become an official UFO and then requalify three out of four calendar quarters. All right. In this plan, I need you to show at least four plans per month to qualified individuals who want to see what you have. So there's what it looks like. There's the skeleton of what we're looking for. Become a professional coordinator. Now, why do we say four? Well, when you sponsor two, you've got some excitement going. I'll never forget the first person I sponsored. Wow, I was impressed. I was so like, man, we're up to the races. But it wasn't until the second one got sponsored, whoa, I am in the money. I'm going to ready to start earning commissions. It's going to start rolling now. Back off, get the bank, bank account. Get me a safe in the house today. Uh, <laughs> I mean, you're excited about what's going on. Now, you sponsor two in each leg, and all of a sudden, you've got some synergy because they start talking about you. So when you sponsor two, they talk about, boy, that dentist is really crazy. Can you believe what he's asking us to do? That's good. That's synergy, okay? But when you get three on each side, all of a sudden, you got some mo. Momentum. I mean, I'm talking, when you got the momentum, it just starts flowing. You're feeling good. You're feeling good. Oh, I can't wait to sell the plan again. Yeah? Okay. The point is, when you got some momentum, you don't want to slow down. That's why we say build fast, not slow. Somebody gets a check and say, I need to take a break. No, you need to speed up. Speed up. Fast is good. Not in everything, but in this business, yes. Yes. And then when you go to four on each leg, there's a term we use called critical mass, and the energy just begins. And whether you wake up or not, your business goes. All right, now. If you do what you're supposed to do, you will be doing the Getting Started Guide. So anyone you recruit must agree to do the Getting Started Guide in the first 12 months. And base 10, 7 strong in the first 3 to 4 months. If it's 6 months, it's okay. So here's what happens. Everybody see that? You're first personally sponsored, you have helped them get activated helped them get their customers, and went through their top 10 and got them activated. So as you go, you get more what? Distribution. Now, ladies and gentlemen, look what just happened with four personally sponsored who agree to build out Base 10 7 Strong with your coaching. Now, what happens is there's 28 UFOs all put into motion the right way, and they're creating 100 personal BV in use and 300 BV in group sales. First point, please listen to me here. This is a point of measurement. If you're personally sponsored, are not using at least 100 BV a product and are not producing 300 BV a month in sales, get your butt in there and help them get to 300 or over. Does everyone, it's not hard. Do you know when you sponsor somebody, they're your asset? Not ass, asset, okay? So why would you sponsor somebody if they're not an asset? Why wouldn't you help them meet up to the specifications for what? Success. Now, but the only problem is, Dennis, it's only 11,200 BV. That's only 3,000 extra dollars a month coming in commissions. Okay, well, let's think about this. We know about shopping annuities, and if we can get our 28 UFOs to buy into a Market America household and become a shopping annuity, we can get another 142 BV out of them. Frank, I know, huh? you got to have tens of thousands of BV coming in just on your personal use to keep you alive. Okay? <laughs> So when I think about that, of course you can pick up some extra BV by teaching them what we do. Bring them to the event. And of course, look at this, the common leg, the secret, 
The foundation of success is in the common leg. Build the common leg. Because each new UFO in that common leg brings in three new distributors. Do you know a distributor will never catch up to their common leg? Never. They'll always have a stronger leg. But do you also know it is a huge incentive to build weak to drive more BV up. So it's like holding the carrot out. You're almost there. You're almost there. Come on. One leg, one leg, and you can get there. And ladies and gentlemen, when you really think about it, it's not, it's only a good thing. You see, we don't dispose of our assets. If, you're, if something's hung up and you can't work, we'll build right through you. And you're going to come back with half a leg. And your ability to place BV, understand the common leg principle. Now, whether you do it one leg at a time or two legs at a time, that's up to you. That's your strategy, but this is what you have to do to build two legs. It's bringing in four personally sponsored that are committed to build out the getting started guide and moving into the right direction, putting things in place for a successful business. What you put in motion carries in motion. Hey, that's, I'm gonna try that tonight. You know, Conquer got a party over the Hard Rock Cafe tonight. You know, just, mm. okay, all right, now, okay. Keys to remember and building the action plan. Always build through the fundamentals. Don't get, listen, there's no shortcut to the shortcut. Just do what we say. Okay, good. Second, you build through base 10, second str uh, seven strong, and every leg that you build should include four personally sponsored. Next, you must have a written goal statement. Believe me, folks, I carry my own. You know that for people that I teach, I carry it with me all the time. My fifth one, 21 years of doing this, I still carry it because when I travel a lot, I need to read this to keep my sanity. Okay? So ladies and gentlemen, I just want you to remember that. First, translate the goal statement into a pin level. Based on what you want to reach your goal, translate it into the pin level. Determine the pin level and the number of business development centers you have to build out and how frequently they have to be flushing, green flushing through. And real quick example, the professional coordinators, one BDC flushing three out of four weeks in a four-week pay cycle. A national earning ten to fifteen thousand dollars is building out two business uh, centers or three legs so you have to personally sponsor 12 distributors and you have to flush one four times and the other one three out of four times and then to become a director where we believe life begins in the business is that you have to open three business development centers sponsor a total of 16 distributors to build out the Getting Started Guide to earn $20,400, and that's a great place to be. Now, you must know how many dedicated hours that you have. Is there anything that's going to hold you back because we need a one-year commitment? Determine if there's any financial restrictions. It's important. Determine the correct startup cost. Open up a business checking account separate from your own, and every new distributor needs to have a minimum of 10 preferred customers, repeat buyers, and they are exceeding 30 business volume. That's why I love the Daily Essentials kit. I love the kits that are coming out. Oh my gosh, they're just so good. I mean, you gotta love those. And just remember, when they buy the kit, move them to the auto ship, because one of the things you gotta remember is that the auto ship, big business, because now it's just shipping automatically, they're never gonna forget, and then it starts to build the shopping annuity. Now, just remember, with the kits, Marketing 101, people will ask you, can I keep getting this same great price, saving $50? And the answer is, I'm not so sure how long the special will be, but if you go on to auto ship, we can lock it in, okay? So start doing that. Get them in there. Marty's done a great job in pulling together prices on this. Everybody's winning. Okay, good. Now, every leg when you build out has four personally sponsored, no exceptions. Even if you get the first one doing well, get four in there. You never know if they forget to do something. <laughs> All right. And 
Your plan of action is only as good as you and the distributor you are working with agree to get it done. All right? They both have to agree to get it done. Don't set up a plan of action that they don't agree to because you can't come back and measure it because they didn't agree to it. So this is very important. Now, people ask me, well, how's the time break up? Well, ladies and gentlemen, for an average person, it takes one person two hours to get one customer. It takes them to talk to four people, sit down with two of them, and it's about two hours for one. So if I wanted two customers a week, I'd spend four hours talking about my products to people, eight different people. If I'm going to sponsor somebody and diagnosing what people have to go, average people, it takes on average 32 hours of work to sponsor somebody into the business correctly. So if you're going to sponsor two per quarter, which is the UFO program, that's 64 hours of work over three months or six hours a week. So ladies and gentlemen, it's four hours to retailing in the beginning, six hours to recruiting. I don't think that's rocket science. I think that's pretty much what it is, okay? Now, people ask me, how about all the other stuff? The mentor calls, the bi-monthly UBPs or HBPs. Well, that's another 48 hours, okay, over a period of months. So we're coming into approximately eight hours a week more. All right, now, without a doubt, 68 hours total, approximately 17 hours a week. But wait a minute, Dennis. That's over the 12 to 15 that I promised. So what do we do? We got a challenge. We teach them how to work smarter. You do product previews. Don't just do it with one person. Do it with many people. Do group interviews. Many of you have several people interviewed at once. Do HBPs. Instead of showing the plan one-on-one, -on -one, show it to three people at one time. And the ABC trial run is as good as any HBP. Right, Johnson? All right, good. Now, it's not harder. What, what do I check on? People always know. What's your secret, Dennis? How'd you do this? Well, it's not too much of a secret. It's basically knowing what you have to do. You pull these out of the Getting Started Guide, and I create a sheet. Possibilities per week. I work off of 312. All right, call three people, book one appointment, add two names, five days a week. So I need 10 possibilities every week. I need how many approaches? I need 15 is what my measurement is because it's three, one, two. This is just me. But if you're not doing this stuff, folks, you're not in control. You're just wishing it works. I'm going to wish this. I'm going to will it. I'm going to wish it. It don't work that way. Okay, you got to do something. You got to do something. Number of plans, ABC trial runs. Hey, listen, do you know what an ABC trial run means? It means you get off your fanny and go out with your new person and show the plan with them. Okay, so some of us are really just tied into tell them to go out to do these things. Then I tie in the meetings. I tie in, did you buy your tickets? And you know what? You have to understand, if people don't buy their tickets, they don't want to do the business because guess what? They don't believe you. So why are you going to work with them? Why do you work with them? So ladies and gentlemen, 12 to 15 hours for two to three years. Two to three years. Look, I'm born, I die, and I'm about here in my life. Here's two to three years. Look at all the time to live. All I'm saying is, this is the right place, the right time, with the right people, so do it. We'll see ya.